Hello everyone and welcome to my bold and beautiful Today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Steffi's Paris move with Kelly and Hayes Finn's bond with Sheila Drive's family out of LA. The bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Steffi Forrester will deliver a fierce warning to John Finn Finnegan during the week of July 31, August 4. In the fate of Kelly Spencer's dread on the sand, Steffi will no doubt be reminded of how fragile life can be. It'll also help Steffi see a further careless side of Finn, and she won't be happy about Sheila Carter's involvement moreover. Finn may defend Sheila for stepping up to help Kelly, but Steffi will presumably argue that the entire fired no way should have happened. Kelly shouldn't have been left unattended, Finn shouldn't have turned his reverse to take a call and Sheila shouldn't have been stalking them hard. It may come apparent to Steffi that Finn can't keep his pledge to cut off all contact with Sheila. Indeed, if Finn kept his end of the bargain, Steffi could no way trust Sheila to stay down. Steffi may also get Finn to admit his passions for Sheila have come more complicated. Finn can't help but feel drawn to his birth mama since she represents commodity that's been missing all his life. Steffi hoped there'd be some explanation for the hugging videotape that would make sense, but Finn obviously won't have one. Liam Spencer will trust Finn less and less with each fleeting moment, so he may want Kelly kept down from him. That could impact Steffi's conduct as she deals with all this as well. Whatever the case, B and B spoilers say Steffi won't authorize of Finn's guest and will do commodity that devastates him as a result. This could lead to Steffi making the decision to leave City with the kitties since she'll be so alarmed and furious. In the history, Steffi has taken extended passages to Paris when she demanded time down to clear her head. Maybe Steffi will decide to travel there again and spend some time pitching in at Forrester International. Steffi may advertise that she's taking Kelly and Hayes Forrester Finnegan with her before telling Finn farewell. As for when Steffi will be back, she may not be sure considering how precarious this whole Sheila situation is. This would be an easy setup for Jacqueline McKinn's Wood's forthcoming motherliness leave and would force Finn to suffer without her back in lay. In the meantime, Liam could always pop over to Paris for visits with Kelly and take this occasion to strengthen his connection to Steffi, indeed off-screen. Anyhow, the bold and the beautiful spoilers say Steffi will give Finn updates on some crushing news, so stay tuned to B&B. &B. Beach Aftermath, Birth Mom Backlash and Skylar's Mission the bold and the beautiful spoilers update for Monday, July 31, indicates that Ridge Forrester will pound over a new design on a Forrester model named Skylar, but Skylar may be far more interested in RJ Forrester and her thing of dating him. Ridge may be rather distracted anyway since life has thrown him so numerous curveballs recently. Between Thomas Forrester sleeping with Hope Logan and Sheila Carter's unanticipated release, Ridge will have a lot to worry about. Still, Brooke Logan may remind Ridge that they also have a lot to be thankful for now that they've set up their way back to each other. Ridge and Brooke are surely dealing with some family drama, but they'll continue to celebrate the news of their reunion. Other B&B &B spoilers say agony will unfold at the sand since Kelly Spencer is floundering against the swells. In a shocking twist, it's Sheila Carter who seems poised to save Kelly from a grim fate. John Finn Finnegan will freak when he gets off the phone and realizes Kelly is in trouble, so he may take over for Sheila after she cautions him to what's going on. Although Finn will be thankful after he carries Kelly to safety, Steffi Forrester may not feel the same way. It's easy to imagine Steffi spinning this around on Sheila and hurling allegations. Steffi might assume Sheila distracted Finn and try to condemn her mama. In law for the peril Kelly was in. Of course, B&B &B suckers know Finn just wasn't paying attention to Kelly who did the work call he was concentrated on. Both Steffi and Liam Spencer will presumably give Finn an earful for being so careless, but there'll be some worries about how close Sheila was to the whole situation as well. Sheila may be idle, but that won't be enough to change Steffi's perspective. Steffi will suppose the ban must be executed and might indeed suppose Sheila should go down for violating the restraining order. The bold and the beautiful spoilers say Finn will defend Sheila and make a major concession, which could involve his messy feelings and evidence on the clinch Liam recorded. Although Finn knows Sheila has a terrible history, decoupling from her will be delicate, especially after she steps up for Kelly. Once Finn gets updates on Liam making that videotape at the courthouse, 
he could he could suspect Liam's working overtime to blow up his marriage. Why are the pens trying to put Finn in a bad light? The bold and the beautiful spoilers say that it's enough afwart then that he's not the adversary. Yet it seems like the pens of the hit CBS cleaner are trying to put der. John Finnegan in the worst light possible. But will it work? Then's what you need to know. The bold and the beautiful spoilers why are the pens trying to put Finn in a bad light? Now that Liam and Hope have disassociated, it seems each too accessible to turn Finn into the bad Joe just so Liam can continue to get what he wants. And in this case, he clearly wants Steffi, but the bold and the beautiful suckers aren't buying it. They would rather spend all day abhorring Liam Spencer, also believing that Finn is putting his family in peril by getting close to his mama Shala Carter again. It goes without saying that numerous the bold and the beautiful suckers have had a lot to say about this plot. Some have indeed reflected with, oh yeah, so accessible Finn's decided to lose his mind. Just in time for the divorce of Liam and hope no bone. Wants Steffi with Liam. On with, say good. Bye to Finn and Steffi's marriage and welcome to further pseudo-man Liam drama. Steffi deserves much better than eternally wimpy Liam. What's next for Finn? Another B&B &B critic wrote, oh my goodness. I swear to God, if B&B &B breaks Finn and Steffi's marriage and Liam and Steffi's are a thing again, I'll be done with their cleaner for good. And also there was this comment as well, I hope the pens and generators of B&B &B are literally seeing these dispatches on this post. No one. Absolutely no one wants Steffi with Liam. I all should hear to your suckers. We're the reason you're still having airplay. The suckers have clearly spoken up, and both loud and clear. In the meantime, let us know what you suppose by leaving us a line with your studies in our commentary section below. The bold and the beautiful charade weekdays on the CBS network. Check your original rosters for times. Kimberlyn Brown shined as Sheila learned she's formerly again a free woman on B&B. &B. Do one ever count Sheila Carter out? The bold and the beautiful villainess managed to cheat the legal system and is formerly again a free woman. Kimberlyn Brown showed a myriad of feelings as Sheila embraced the fates giving her another chance at the happiness that always sounded to escape her. Kimberlyn Brown, performer of the week Bill's plan blew up in his and everyone's face once Judge Even Scott revealed he'd to throw out the case against Sheila because the substantiation was immorally obtained. However, Brown didn't betray that bit of information in her character's response to the news if Sheila saw this coming. Still, Sheila couldn't help but be enraptured after learning she was free. Her joy was slightly tempered by the fact that her confident Mike is still confined. We say slightly because Brown brought a big smiling grin to Sheila's face in front of Mike. She's sad he's still stuck in the slammer but Sheila is overjoyed she's been freed and Brown decided to let that joy shine through in her performance. They gave me life. Sheila informed her confidant. They gave me my life back, Mike. My future, my freedom. Mike was incredulous to hear that Sheila's charges were dismissed and that she was getting an alternate chance. Let's be honest, it's more like a ninth or tenth chance. The irony that Mike has ended up behind bars and she hasn't been jugged was not lost on the mischievous nanny. She sounded relatively sincere when she thanked him for everything that he'd done for her. Sheila made Mike's dream come true when she gave him a tender kiss. She also didn't hide her enthusiasm about getting another chance to be a mama to Finn and grandmother in a haze. After being back out in society, Sheila made sure she visited Deacon at his apartment. Sure, he played a part in her getting caught, but Sheila chose to concentrate on the good times she and Deacon participated. I am back, Daddy. Sheila manically laughed as she and Deacon participated a celebratory grasp and further. Sheila madly participated with Cleric her experience for the future. She's not interested in dwelling on her sorely, learning from her history, or does she? An enthusiastic Sheila keeps professing to Deacon that she's not going to waste her recently set up freedom. She followed Finn and Kelly to the sand to commence immediate stalking. Still, thanks to Finn taking his eyes off of Kelly, Sheila's now poised to play heroine. It looks like B&B &B has indeed set up a way to keep Sheila Carter and Kimberlyn Brown around for quite some time. Just as Sheila has nine toes, she also has nine lives.